This video shows how to create a Salesforce connection in Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services Administrator and the two authentication methods you can use to connect to Salesforce. Before you begin, make sure you have the username and password that you use to log into Salesforce. There are two authentication methods that you can use to connect to Salesforce. With standard authentication, you need the username, password, and security token for your Salesforce account. With OAuth authentication, you need the consumer key, consumer secret, and refresh token. First, we'll get the information we need to use authentication with the Salesforce connection. Log in to your Salesforce account. For standard authentication, you'll need a security token. So go to your account settings and reset the security token. Salesforce sends the security token to the email listed in your account. To generate the consumer key and consumer secret for OAuth authentication, we'll go to Setup and create a new connected app. Make a note of the consumer key and the consumer secret. To generate the refresh token, go to Informatica Marketplace and search for the SFDC OAuth 2.0 tool. We've added a link to the download page in the description below the video. Next, you'll download the Salesforce OAuth 2.0 tool and follow the instructions. Make a note of the refresh token. So now we'll create a Salesforce connection. In Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services, go to the My Services page and open Administrator. Click Connections and create a new connection. First, we'll name the connection and then select Salesforce as the connection type. Select a runtime environment. Next, select the authentication method you want to use to connect to Salesforce. First, we'll show you the standard method. Enter the username, password, and the security token for the Salesforce account. You can keep the default URL for the Salesforce service endpoint. To use a different API version, see the Salesforce documentation for the supported API versions. Now we've finished configuring the connection with standard authentication, so let's test it. It's successful, so we'll save it. Now we'll show you how to configure a Salesforce connection with OAuth authentication. Enter the consumer key, consumer secret, and the refresh token. Test the connection to validate it, and then save the connection. That's it! Now you can use the connection in a cloud data integration mapping to read data from and write data to Salesforce. For more information, see the Salesforce Connector Guide on the Informatica documentation portal. Visit our communities and support hubs, or check out our website.